Yeah, I remember this used to be the old Sizzlers. That's what we heard. Yeah. <laughs> okay, I love blue. Blue's blue. always been my favorite color. Okay. Even when I was young. All right. Yeah. Okay, one. Well, what is your name? Uh, Marilyn. It's M A R. Oops. M A R I L Y N. I L Y N. Yeah, like Marilyn Monroe, but I'm not her, and I'm not Marilyn Manson. Okay. <laughs> I tell people that. <laughs> but where did you say you live? Right down. I live down the street here, at the Jefferson. Oh, at the Jefferson. Yes. Yeah. Oh wow. I live in an SRO too. Yeah. I, I know some people that live in here upstairs at the Cadillac. How do you like the Jefferson? I've been there, what, almost 10 years? Oh, wow. Yeah, okay. I've been to shelters and all that stuff. Yeah. And then one time, uh, St. Anthony's used to have their women's shelter over on 8th and Mission. I remember the Yeah, but now it's a rest space and some the city took over. Oh, I didn't know that. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, so that's why I used to, I was there. And then the, when they, uh, the city brought them over, and then they asked me where I want to go. And I said, well... Let me see. I want six admissions. So I said, I'll stay here in the Tenderloin. Okay. But I've been here since then. And then, plus, I volunteer at my Curry Senior Center. Oh, right. Plus, okay. I'm a client, too. Oh, okay. I've been there, what, nine years? Oh, wow. Yeah. Well, so now I just volunteer, volunteer. Yeah, that's great that you can do it's, that. But it gives me something to do in the morning. Plus, I'm just me and my shadow. Just, I have a family. So oh, really? they really give me something to do. Oh, wow. But a lot of the clients, they know me. But the thing is, I'm the only one that they like talking to because I talk to everybody. Right. Like, I tell people, I don't care who you are, what you are. To me, we're all the same. Yeah. Whatever you do behind your closed door, I don't care what you do. Right. And they, a lot of them, they come up to me and they think I'm staff. I said, no, talk to staff. <laughs> because, I, you know, I'm open to everybody. That's really good. Yeah. 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 Now, I get along with everybody. Some of my friends, they, haven't, they don't come no more, but they still see me outside. And they say hi. They'll say hi, yeah. Some of my friends, can I get a hug from you, Marilyn? I said, okay. But it makes their day. It does. And then everybody wants a hug, probably. Oh, I don't. No, I want a hug. But you know what I do? A friend of mine is the one who got me started this. Mm-hmm. And she, I said, she tell me it's a heart-to-heart hug. That's you know, you give your heart to That's She's the one got me started. And they can they can feel it too. Oh, they, they can if feel you it. Mean it, and then they end up liking it. <laughs> of course. Yeah. Sometimes my friend Marilyn, I want my hug, and I said, okay. <laughs> You're like, okay. Yes, no worry, I'll give you your hug. Even some of the security guards that comes over now to our senior center, they've been monitoring our place too. Yeah. And then one guy, he comes up when he comes, he comes upstairs to see me. I said, okay, Willie, here's your hug. <laughs> I'm the only one that does it. Yeah, well, I think people really they And they, sometimes they appreciate it. Yeah. And then no matter who you are, I don't care. Yeah. You know. They probably look forward to it. And well, I don't mind. It's a bad day, but I know I can get a hug. Yeah. Some people are that way. Sometimes one guy, one guy, he yeah, must have had a little day, and they say, can I get a hug? And I say, of course you may. And sometimes I feel like the referee upstairs. So one time, one guy I got into with another friend. I said, "Let it go, drop it." Oh, like a like an argument. Yeah, an argument. Oh. And then when I went to my other place, other senior was part of Curry, and one guy he got mad at for me for no reason, and then the next day he apologized. Oh. And he said, "Girl, I'm sorry." I said, "It's all good." I forgive you this time, but don't let it happen again. Right. And another time, I was trying to help. Yeah. And one time, I was trying to help this other guy. He must have took it the wrong way, so he didn't talk to me for a whole week. And then later, the following week, he said to me, he said, I'm sorry for what I did. I think I took it the wrong way. I said, it's okay. I'll forgive you. (laughs) He ended up apologizing after a whole week. (laughs) I guess he felt bad, and he knew he was wrong. He knew he was wrong, and he probably thought yeah, about it. after he thought that about it. Because I was trying to help him, and he, it just happened, you know, he took, he took it the wrong way. And I, you what know, I tried you to, he said, I'm sorry. I said, it's okay. Don't worry about it. It's all good. See, that made him happy right mm-hmm. there. You forgave him, and it was all good. I, I know, because sometimes I'm talking to people of different race. I, I like, I'm Chinese. Yeah. I love my own kind, but sometimes they, they give me this look like, just because I'm talking to somebody of different Really? Yeah, seriously. I get that a lot. What, do they think you're not supposed to, or what is that? Well, I grew, see, I grew up in L.A., Yeah. and I grew up with a mix of diversity, a group of everybody. Right. And my parents were not that way. 
but like they were not that way that you shouldn't talk to anybody who's not no, Chinese. No, they let me whoever I want. Yeah. yeah. But people who look at you that way, what do you think they're thinking? I think Jesus, you know, they don't like it too bad. But one time I was talking to somebody, I forgot where I was, and this is a transgender, I know somebody, and we know each other. Yeah. And we ended up talking, we gave each other a hug, and all this, this Chinese lady looked at me, and I told Chinese, you have a problem? I just looked at her, and then she walked away. But I mean, what? why did they... Because I'm not problem. I'm just because I'm Chinese, I just talk to my own you're kind. You're not a, oh, you're supposed to only talk to your own kind. Yeah, like that kind. They're always like that. No one trusts somebody who's not Chinese. Yeah. Like I'm trying to understand why. No, I don't know. Some people are that way. They're just type. Yeah. For me, it don't matter. 